Ever wondered what makes Sao Paulo a must-visit city? Well, fasten your virtual seatbelts, as we're about to take you on a whirlwind tour of this vibrant heart of South America. Sao Paulo is more than just a city, it's a melting pot of cultures, a symphony of sounds, colors, and flavors. It's a city where the past and the future are intermingled in a beautiful dance, where skyscrapers tower over colonial-era buildings, and where the streets echo with the rhythm of samba and the aroma of world-class cuisine. This city is a testament to the resilience and spirit of the Brazilian people. Its rich history is written in its architecture, its streets, and in the hearts of its inhabitants. From the indigenous tribes who first called this land home, to the Portuguese explorers and immigrants from around the world, each has left their indelible mark on Sao Paulo. This is a city that celebrates its diversity, where every culture is not just represented, but embraced and cherished. But Sao Paulo isn't just about history. It's a city that pulses with the energy of the present. It's a city that never sleeps, where the hustle and bustle of city life is a constant soundtrack. From the business tycoons in the financial district, to the artists in the cultural quarter, everyone here is constantly on the move, constantly creating, constantly evolving. Over the course of this video, we're going to take you through some of the must-visit landmarks in the city. We'll explore the iconic Paulista Avenue, soak in the beauty of the enchanting Ibirapuera Park, marvel at the majestic Sao Paulo Cathedral, and experience the vibrant Mercado Municipal. Each of these places tells a unique story, a chapter in the grand narrative that is Sao Paulo. So, are you ready to embark on a journey to explore the marvels of Sao Paulo? Imagine strolling down the iconic Paulista Avenue, the soul of Sao Paulo. Known as the city's beating heart, this bustling thoroughfare is more than just a road. It's a vibrant cultural hub, a symbol of Sao Paulo's ceaseless energy, and a testament to its rich history. Paulista Avenue, or Avenida Paulista as locals call it, dates back to the late 19th century. Initially a residential area for the city's affluent, it has morphed into a commercial powerhouse over the years. Today, it stands as a remarkable blend of the old and the new. This three-kilometer stretch is adorned with towering skyscrapers that house multinational corporations and banks. Yet, amidst this modernity, echoes of the past still resound. The elegant Casa das Rosas, a historic mansion turned cultural center, is one such gem. Offering a window into Sao Paulo's aristocratic past, it's a stark contrast to the avenue's otherwise contemporary facade. As you walk along Paulista Avenue, you'll find more than just office buildings. It's a shopper's paradise, with a plethora of retail options ranging from high-end designer boutiques to local artisanal shops. It's also a food lover's dream, with a smorgasbord of enticing cafes and eateries, reflecting Sao Paulo's diverse culinary scene. But what truly sets Paulista Avenue apart is its dynamic cultural scene. It's home to the Sao Paulo Museum of Art, a world-class institution that boasts a stunning collection of Brazilian art. It's also the site of numerous cultural events, street performances, and festivals that bring the avenue to life. At night, the avenue transforms into an entertainment hotspot, with lively bars and clubs adding to the city's vibrant nightlife. Yet, even amidst the hustle and bustle, it retains a welcoming charm that invites one to pause, take a breath, and soak in the city's spirit. Indeed, a visit to Sao Paulo would be incomplete without experiencing the pulse of Paulista Avenue. Next, we find ourselves in the enchanting Ibirapuera Park, an oasis amidst the city's hustle and bustle. It's like stepping into another world, a tranquil escape from the frenetic pace of Sao Paulo, Stretching over 390 acres, this park is an emblem of the city's commitment to preserving natural spaces. Beneath the canopy of towering trees, you'll find lush, verdant spaces where nature thrives. The park is home to a variety of flora, some native to Brazil, others imported from around the world, creating a unique blend of greenery that's a feast for the eyes. Tranquil lakes dot the landscape, their mirror-like surfaces reflecting the beauty of the surroundings and providing a habitat for a variety of aquatic life. But Ibirapuera Park isn't just about flora and fauna, 
It's also a hub of culture and history, with iconic monuments scattered throughout its expanse. The Obelisk of Sao Paulo, a towering structure of pure white, stands as a testament to the city's past. It's a sight to behold, rising majestically against the backdrop of the park's greenery. There's no shortage of activities to enjoy in Ibirapuera Park. Leisurely strolls along the park's winding pathways provide an opportunity to fully embrace the serenity of this place. For the fitness enthusiasts, the park's jogging tracks and bicycle routes offer a refreshing setting for a good workout. And for those who prefer a slower pace, the park's expansive green spaces are perfect for picnicking or simply relaxing, book in hand, under the shade of a tree. Children's laughter can often be heard echoing through the park as they enjoy the playgrounds and wide open spaces. Ibirapuera Park truly offers something for everyone, making it a must-visit spot when in Sao Paulo. As the day draws to a close and the sun begins to set, the park takes on a magical quality. The sky, painted with hues of orange and pink, reflects off the lakes, creating a spectacle that's nothing short of breathtaking. Ibirapuera Park, a breath of fresh air in the heart of Sao Paulo, this enchanting oasis is a testament to the city's love for nature and culture, a place where both coexist in perfect harmony. Now, let us step into the majestic Sao Paulo Cathedral, a testament to the city's rich architectural history. Situated in the heart of Sao Paulo, there stands a magnificent structure that has been a witness to the city's evolution for over a century. This is the Sao Paulo Cathedral, a symbol of the city's vibrant cultural and architectural heritage. The cathedral's grandeur is reflected in its stunning neo-Gothic design, a style that was popular in the late 19th and early 20th centuries. With its towering spires stretching towards the sky, it's no surprise that the cathedral is one of the largest churches in Brazil, and indeed the world. But the Sao Paulo Cathedral is more than just an architectural marvel, it's a living, breathing testament to the city's deep-rooted Catholic faith. It's where generations of Polistanos, as the locals are known, have come to worship, pray, and find solace. The cathedral's history is as rich and layered as the city itself. Its construction began in the early 20th century and took four decades to complete. Over the years, it has survived not just the passage of time, but also the city's rapid urbanization and the tumult of World War II. Inside, the cathedral is as awe-inspiring as its exterior. Stained glass windows cast a kaleidoscope of colors onto the marble floors, and the grand organ, one of the largest in Latin America, fills the air with divine music. Yet, the cathedral's true beauty lies in its ability to bring people together. It's a place where the city's diverse communities gather to celebrate life's milestones, from christenings and weddings to funerals. It's a place where faith transcends language and love transcends boundaries. In a city that's known for its skyscrapers, the Sao Paulo Cathedral stands out not just for its physical presence, but for its spiritual significance. It's a reminder of the city's past, a symbol of its present, and a beacon of hope for its future. Sao Paulo Cathedral, a beacon of spiritual and architectural grandeur. Lastly, we cannot miss out on the vibrant Mercado Municipal, a paradise for food lovers. This is not just a market, it's a gastronomic adventure. Known locally as Mercadao, or Big Market, this is where the city's pulse can be truly felt. It's a bustling, vibrant hub, filled with the chatter of vendors, the laughter of customers, and the clatter of pots and pans. Imagine the sights, sounds and smells of fresh produce from all over Brazil and beyond. The air, heavy with the aroma of exotic fruits, freshly caught fish, local cheeses, and a myriad of spices. The market is a riot of colors, from the rainbow hues of tropical fruits to the earthy tones of dried goods and spices. At the Mercado Municipal, you'll find an extraordinary variety of foods. From fruits you've never heard of, to meats and cheeses from every corner of the country. It's like stepping into a food encyclopedia, where every stall has a different chapter to tell. And let's not forget about the local delicacies. You simply cannot leave without trying the iconic Mortadella Sandwich, a Sao Paulo classic. Picture this, a towering sandwich, stacked high with thin slices of mortadella, a type of Italian sausage, 
served warm inside a crunchy baguette. It's a mouth-watering delight that is as much a part of Sao Paulo's identity as the market itself. For the sweet-toothed, there's pastel de Belém, a creamy, flaky custard tart that melts in your mouth, or fruta do conde, a sweet, custard-like fruit that's like nothing you've tasted before. The Mercado Municipal is more than just a food market, it's a place to explore, to taste and to experience. It's a place where every sense is engaged, where every taste bud is tantalized. It's a culinary journey through the heart of Brazil, one bite at a time. Mercado Municipal, a feast for the senses in Sao Paulo. As we leave the delightful tastes and smells of the Mercado Municipal behind, we embark on a journey to the lively neighborhood of Vila Madalena. Known for its bohemian vibe, Vila Madalena is a melting pot of creativity and culture. But what truly sets it apart is its mesmerizing street art. The walls here tell a story, each one a canvas for the city's artists to express their ideas, their passions and their dreams. Our first stop is the famous Beko do Batman, or Batman's Alley. This narrow street is a riot of color, with every inch covered in vibrant murals and graffiti. It's like walking through an open-air museum, where the exhibits change every day. The art here is a reflection of Sao Paulo itself, diverse, dynamic, and full of life. It's a place where you can lose yourself in the intricate details of each piece, where you can feel the energy and emotion that went into creating it. But Beko do Batman is just the beginning. The entire neighborhood is a street art paradise, with stunning murals adorning the walls of shops, restaurants and residential buildings. Each piece is unique, reflecting the personality of the artist and the spirit of the city. From thought-provoking pieces that tackle social issues to whimsical creations that celebrate the joy of life, there's something for everyone. As we walk through the streets of Vila Madalena, let's take a moment to appreciate this unique form of expression, this vibrant testament to Sao Paulo's creativity and resilience. Whether you're an art lover or not, the street art of Vila Madalena is sure to leave you inspired and in awe. Vila Madalena, where the streets are alive with color and creativity. Our journey through Sao Paulo continues as we leave the vibrant streets of Vila Madalena behind and head towards Barafunda. As the sun sets, this neighborhood comes alive, transforming into a bustling hub of nightlife. Here, you'll find a mix of traditional samba clubs, avant-garde theaters, and hip bars, making it a playground for night owls and culture enthusiasts alike. Our first stop is the SESC Pompeia, a cultural center that hosts a variety of performances, from music concerts to theater productions. Its unique architectural design is a sight to behold, especially when it's all lit up at night. Next, we step into one of the many samba clubs in the area. The rhythm is infectious, the energy palpable, locals and tourists alike get swept up in the music, dancing till the early hours of the morning. But the night is still young in Barafunda. We head to the trendy bars that line the streets, each one offering its own unique ambience and signature cocktails. Whether you're looking to dance the night away, indulge in some late-night gastronomy, or simply soak in the vibrant atmosphere, Barra Funda has it all. As we immerse ourselves in the nightlife of Sao Paulo, we're reminded that this city truly never sleeps. It's a city of contrasts, where tradition and modernity coexist, where every neighborhood has a story to tell. And as we wrap up our journey, we hope that you've enjoyed this glimpse into the heart and soul of Sao Paulo. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe and comment on our next travel destination.